Bringing together the European Common Space for Alternatives was a really difficult and long process. However, it was really important because we don't have enough transnational connection. This is a first step towards bringing together diverse and several European uh, movements from human rights to climate justice to workers' rights. On a plus assez d'eau. Et avec ça, on va encore nous vendre, euh, pardon, nous acheter les pieds de carbone qui nous reste avec des bons. L'extractivisme euh, qui se colle qui s'est coloré en vert avec la question de la transition écologique qui ne change pas de paradigme actuel, mais qui veut le, le continuer en le peignant en vert. Dans les années 2010, on s'est fait complètement submerger euh, par ce, ce, ce tsunami euh, néolibéral. Là, il y a peut-être, et euh, aujourd'hui, et, et vraiment dans ce, dans ce processus européen, une, cette dynamique euh, altermondialiste qu'il va falloir recoordonner entre différents continents. Essayer d'avoir une convergence de discussions entre la crise de la démocratie et la montée de l'extrême droite. Aiming to make life in the UK basically unlivable for irregular migrants. So it criminalizes work without legal status. Whether someone likes your headscarf or doesn't like your headscarf or whatever you're wearing, this is not what this is about. This is state-sanctioned Islamophobia and misogyny, which is, excuse the pun, being used as a veil, okay, to attack all our civil liberties and to dehumanize huge numbers of people we still live in a Europe that accepts the incitement of genocide, that is complicit in genocide, <coughs> and only time will demonstrate the very obvious truth behind the words of which I speak now. The amount of people they managed to gather and the diversity of the groups was really, really impressive. And I was particularly satisfied by the, the intention that the team had to always create a space for disagreement and to find the disagreements so that way we can know what we need to work on. This is something that is not so usual. And the goal is to improve our combined efforts. So when we think the future of EXA, we have really to be responsible to ourselves and to the people we want to convince. How we build convergence even and hope, and it's good that we are divided and even we are divided on very important issues. And clarifying the points where we disagree will be an essential step in moving forward with EXA, but also with our individual organization fights. And actually for me, it never was a problem to feel and to build this uh, solidarity feeling and to start the dialogue with the Palestinians, Lebanese, in fact, it's the first people who uh, showed me their solidarity because it's the people who really know what is to go through the genocide and invasion. On sait que, y compris les conditions dans lesquelles les travailleurs gazaouis, euh, après le 7 octobre, ont été arrêtés, traités, etc. On peut comprendre euh, comment, euh, y compris, euh, le, la question coloniale, elle pèse de façon absolument décisive sur, les, sur, sur le monde du travail. And factually, Palestinians have the legal right to resist. Stop the genocide in Gaza and also the question of Europe's continuing colonialism in the global south. EXA is really a moment of convergence. Um, it's also a moment to look back at uh, the successes and failures of our movements over the past uh, decade or so and construct a more powerful convergence uh, to change the future. I was really excited to meet so many brilliant friends and other activists and people who aren't involved in politics around Europe. My experience with EXA uh, is that I find this quite uh, interesting to have these spaces uh, to network and also new about projects, campaigns and other organizations that are working toward a better uh, social justice uh, future. J'avais cinq ans et malgré mon très jeune âge, je me souviens de tout et je me souviens surtout de la violence euh, de, de tout ce que j'ai vu, du génocide à la guerre dans les camps de réfugiés et de la violence du système d'asile et migration en Belgique quand on est arrivé. Forcing regulation of big capital, taxation, uh, stop this 
uh, extreme concentration of wealth in a few people. Uh, lutter contre ce géant qui est le capitalisme, la crise du patriarcat évidemment avec toutes ces femmes uh, qui et toutes ces hommes, enfin toutes ces personnes qui uh, se battent pour l'émancipation des femmes et des personnes LGBT. Um, but I think it's obviously really essential for us to come together as leftist movements um, and to learn from each other. And I really hope that going forward, these intergenerational bonds formed here continue. The European Common Space for Alternatives is just the beginning. This event is the start of a long-term process where we will continue to meet and act together. So join us. If you feel that there is something to be done in this space, that you've met some people you can work with in this space, then please make it yours.